He's like, you know, people really want to see you. And I, I think that was part of it too. I think a little bit of it was like, hmm, like, did, should I really, do I really belong in a convention? And so being here, meeting all of you has really kind of been a great experience. And I'm telling folks, Volcon has really set the bar high for any future conventions. I guess. Well, it's kind of neat that, that we, we've kind of, shall we say, you know, entered you into the world yes. of, of, of sci-fi conventions. Yes. And I, I think it's really cool that you, you've come here to do it and you've had a great experience. I have. I, I, on so many levels. I mean, well, first of all, everyone is just so, so kind and, 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 and polite and, and so enthusiastic about, about the whole Star Trek world. It's a little intimidating in a good way because it's like, wow, I mean, the knowledge is just tremendous. Um, and I've also had time to sightsee and, and, and check out the town of Vul Vulcan and, and then I've gone to High River and I've been able to go out to Calgary and so I've gotten like, it's almost like a weird convention vacation, you know? <laughs> well, I think it's really cool that you got to go and look at High River again because mm -hmm. it's got so many film yeah. and TV shows that are shooting there now yeah. and have in the past. Right. And, uh, you know, so it's something that obviously as an actress you think it might be kind of cool. It, well, it was amazing. I mean, I think the, the thing that I was, so, I, you know, forgive me, but I, I did not know about Heartland. I just, I just didn't. And now that I know all about it, I can't wait to see it. But I think what I'm so impressed with is that there's an actual working, living town that actually functions as a film set. And just to walk through the streets of downtown High River and see, you know, Maggie's Diner, which I actually thought was a real diner. I was actually going to try to go have lunch there until, because they don't tell you on the brochure that, that it's not a real diner. They make it sound like, go, go to the diner where they film Heartland. So I thought, oh, I'll go to the diner and eat. And then there's, it's, there's no diner. <laughs> no, 100% movie show. And I do. I think, I think you do that on purpose. I'm like, oh, that's just to trick us, you know? We, we like to mess with the folks when yeah. they come to town because half a third is movie sets. Yeah. There's, it's surprising how many people will try to go into those buildings. Well, I'm sure. And well, you know, it's funny because one looks so real because the, the signage looked real. And I, and I looked in the window and I was like, oh my goodness. I'm like, this isn't a real store. It, it, it's, it was fantastic. So as an actor, I don't know, it's just something really cool about it. It's sort of the combination of movie magic and reality blending in, and it's awesome. Now, I know you did a couple of guest stints on, on Star Trek The mm -hmm. Next Generation and on Voyager. Yes. So uh, talk to me a little bit about the fans here, because I know that they all they knew who you were. They had questions. Yeah, you know, I, I, you know, I really didn't know what to expect. I mean, I knew it would be, you know, Star Trek fans, but the the level of detail that, that, that the fans here know and, and just the dedication. I mean, my goodness, you have a town dedicated to Star Trek. I mean, that's, that's like incredible. I mean, it's incredible to come here and just see the Enterprise out there and, and then to go into the visitor center. Um, and then the street lights, the little Enterprise street lights are adorable, you know? And then of course there's the amazing Spaccuccino that I drank. So, um, you know, just the fact that the fans have such dedication to this to this series and, and, and to the world of Star Trek that they were able to sort of have this town become the Star Trek town. It's just, I just think it's amazing. Well, you know, I, again, we, we would love to see you come back at some point. Hopefully, tell some of the other actors that you know, maybe come on down. I and, will. And what a great place. I will. Is. You still haven't gotten Michael Dorn. Is that what you said? No, we haven't had Michael Dorn. All right. Dorn yet. Well, I'll somehow find Michael Dorn and say, you know, you got to come check out Vulcan, and I think he'll have a great time. <laughs> Oh! <laughs>